A hole opens up at a Bay Area high school, and we are working to learn if that hole that opened up on the campus of Tarpon Springs High School today is more than just a pit. News Channel 8's Jamel Linnae joins us now live from Gulf Road, where the area has been fenced off, but still a lot of questions tonight. A lot of questions. Good evening to you. Well, let me show you. Here's the fence. It has been set up, and right now, uh, officials, they're eventually going to start putting that dirt, that pile of dirt you see there on the side. They're going to start putting it in the hole, and then engineers will start doing, or scientists will start doing the ground testing. Quinn Creedon couldn't take his drivers at test this morning. A massive hole at Tarpon Springs High School left part of the campus blocked off. We uh, have driver's ed in the second period. We went there and we noticed there was caution tape all along where we uh, do driver's ed, the whole parking lot, and that got delayed for us. Other students heard about the hole during class. Faculty discovered the 12 foot pit early this morning outside the Culinary Arts Building. Well, I heard about it while I was testing this morning. I just heard over the intercom that like students couldn't go over to culinary. There wasn't a lot of kids in my class, but everyone was like pretty scared, worried at first, but I, I saw it and it doesn't seem too bad. So District leaders tell us the hole is not a threat and doesn't appear to be growing, but was a concern. So because of the close proximity to the culinary arts building, students who are taking classes in that building today have been moved to a different area of campus. Engineers will soon ground test to determine what it is. The hole now a driving force and holding up Credence shot behind the wheel. It's really important because we're doing testing for Jara Z and we get graded basically on the whole year of learning for Jara Z. And engineers tell us that this area could be closed off going into the early part of next week. In Tarpon Springs, Jamel and A, News Channel 8.